Hello everybody, Swami Nath here. Today we are going to do stock transfer order between storage location. They call it STO with batch management. SAP, MM, S4. And between plant, a link has been provided in the description. Check the link. So now the steps I'm going to do is I'm going to create a material in MM01, create a batch in MSC1 and extend the material to other storage location and create purchase order, good system, invoice certification and do transfer posting. Now, one step procedure 311 and two step procedure is 313 and 315. And the plant is MA03, storage location MA03, storage location MA04. The, these two storage location belongs to the plant MA01. So it's been assigned to the plant. If you want to know how to create a plant, a link has been provided in the description. Check that. Link. Let's get to the subject. Let's go to the live system. This is my live system. Go to MM01. I'm going to create a material. Mechanical engineering. Select Z raw material. Raw material. So my raw material is this. Press enter. And enter. My views are, I don't want this sales views. I don't want the sales views. My plant is MA03. Storage location MA03. Present. This is my material. Let me take a note of this material first. This is my material. Now, my description. Enter. Base unit of measure each. Enter. Select batch. See here? Batch. Batch. Now press enter. Enter. No MRP. Metal requirement planning MRP is no MRP. Enter. 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 Select valuation class. My valuation class is 3000 is my valuation. And let me save this. Now I am going to extend this material to other storage location also. MSC, MMSC, MMSC is my transfer. My plant is MA03, press enter. MA04, MA04 is my other storage location, MA04. Now let me select it by press enter and save. Now let's come back. I have just extended it. Now I'm going to create batch. Let me create batch slash in MSC one end batch. Let me enter storage location MSC MA03 is my storage location. Okay, click on to okay. Date of manufacture, shelf life expiry date, and available from date. All these three attributes is assigned to this batch. To this batch. Now press enter and save. And let me save this. For the other story location also, I'm creating another batch. Same. Same attributes I'm assigning. And save it. Now, let's come back. I'm going to do slash in MP21N. I'm going to create a purchase order, goods receipt, and invoice. Let me enter. Let me close this. Enter. Supplier. MA01 is by purchase organization, purchasing group. Enter. Oh, order overview. In the overview, enter the material number. I want to enter 100 materials. Quantity 100. Enter plan. 
MA01, MA03 is my plan. Storage location, MA03. Net price is 50,000. And let me enter the batch. Select the batch. Press enter. The first batch, I'm going to enter the first batch. Press enter. And let me save this. Save. Let me take the purchase order number here. Take the purchase order number. Let me do goods reserve. Go to slash and MI2. I'm going to do goods reserve. Purchase order. Goods reserved and purchase order. Purchase order. Enter. Purchase order number here. See the batch. It's coming in the batch. 4A. This is my batch. This is my batch. Now, item OK and post. Let me do item OK and post. Item OK and post. It just got posted. Now, let me check MMB. Go to MMB. Let me delete storage location. Batch. Let me delete batch also. Execute. See here for this batch just come. Another one more batch I have that is two batches. Nine zero is my batch. Another one is nine zero. Now let's go to MIRO and do invoice certification. Go to slash and MIRO. I'll do invoice certification. GB10 is my company. GB10 is my company. Press enter. Calculate tax. Enter invoice date. Today's date. Press enter. And enter purchase order number here. Enter. Let me select the purchase order number. Let me select the purchase order number from here. Invoicing party is 1468 is my invoicing party. Let me select it from here. Execute. Execute. Supplier alone, I am entering it. Select this. Public. Press enter. And this is the amount I have to please 135700. Enter baseline date and save it. Save it. Now I'm going to do stock transfer order. Let's do stock transfer order. Go to big O slash and MI one step procedure and two step procedure. Select transfer posting. Other 311 is my 311 is my between storage location to storage location. Now let's enter the material number here. First material. This is my material. Enter plant MA03 storage location MA03. Press enter. Let me enter the batch here. First batch, which I have created it now. MSC1 and this is the batch I have created it. And storage location, MA04. It's another one more storage location. This is the batch I have created it now. Now I have created an MSC1 and enter. Enter the quantity, 10 quantity, and post it. Now let's check MMB. Go to MMB and let me refresh this. We should have been transferred. See here, 10 quantity has been transferred to MA04. Now, two step procedure stock and transit. 313 and 315. Let's go to 313 and 315. Second scenario. Let's enter the material, transfer posting. Enter the material. Enter plan. Enter storage location. Press enter. Enter. Destination storage location, same batch. I'm going to enter the batch. Enter same batch. From this batch to another batch. 
four eighty nine to four ninety. Now we enter the quantity. Let's enter the quantity. Go to the quantity and ten quantity. Let me post this or control S save. Now let's go and refresh this. Let's refresh this. It, it will be in stock and transit. Stock and transit. Let's check it. To your right. Transit stock. See a transit stock. This is the transit stock. Now I'm going to receive it in 315. Moment type 315. Now let's go to moment type 315. One five. See three one five. Press enter. Go to the same material, plant, storage location. Press enter. Storage location, other storage location, MA04. My batch is same. Same batch, which I have created it earlier. Both the batches I have created it earlier. Quantity, 10 quantity. Now let me post this. 315 second step. Deficit. Why is this deficit in the sense? 359. Let's check it. Quantity material. Let's do it all over again. Let's save it. Already posted it is coming. Now, let me enter it again. MA03, MA03, MA04, MA04. Let me enter the batch here. Let me enter the quantity, 10 quantity. Let's enter and let me post this same error. No class could be determination. Let me refresh this. It's still a stock and transit only, transit stock only, but we have to receive it. Slash and MI to the a receive, receiving it, should be in receiving. Receiver MA03 MA04 receiving from it should be opposite MA03. Now the batch should be 90 receiving 89 should be 89 source should be opposite. I made a small mistake. Now 10 quantity and post. Now it will drop. See, posted. Now let me refresh this. It have been transferred. Now no stock and transfer. It have been transferred. See here. No stock and transfer. See here. So it has been received. This is how you do. With the batch, you do stock transfer order between storage. Thank you.